Hello, in this video we will describe how we do the penetration testing of the 3CX PBX software. The test has two parts. The first part is control of quality of service. Here the starting TC tester generates real VoIP calls between extensions, check the audio quality and generates reports. Here we see that the SIP tester is configured to register on the six extensions and make calls between the extensions using a custom CallXML script. Here is the script. The script starts with call between extensions. When the call is answered, the software waits for 10 seconds and plays pitch.web audio file and at the same time it starts audio verification. It expects to receive the exactly same audio file back to the caller side. Because in the incoming CallXML script we see that the SIP tester accepts the call immediately and plays the exactly same audio back to caller side through the PBX. So the outgoing script verifies audio against the reference file, it measures audio quality and saves results into confidence collection variable and it also measures round trip delay. If a measured quality is below 97%, the SIP tester saves the recording into debug media folder. It is configured here. And we can manually check the recordings using an audio editor. We see that this file is silent, which is wrong. These two audio files are a result of an old test when the PBX was not correctly configured. And for current tests, there are no bad recordings. The CallXML script says measured quality, confidence score, from 0 to 100 and delay in milliseconds into CDR into custom headers and we can see the CDR here we see that the confidence is pretty good we can also monitor the quality in report statistics screen in a chart Two most important indicators of this test are confidence, which means audio quality, and answer delay, which indicates how fast the call is answered and the connection is established. We see two small peaks of 100 milliseconds. It is normal. Okay, I have explained to you how the quality testing server works and now I will explain to you how we do the VoIP attack. In the current penetration test we presume that the attacker already knows usernames and passwords of few VoIP accounts and he is able to register and make calls between the extensions as it is done in the previous server. The call XML script define the VoIP attacks and here we try to crash the 3CX PBX using malformed C packets and by overloading the server by too many ACK packets. We work on various methods to send invalid C packets. This will be updated. Our code uses random generator to create random changes in the C packets. In our log, we see that SIP tester transmits malformed SIP packets like this. We see that the 3CX responds with 400 bad request response. It means that the PBX successfully handled the malformed SIP packet. And we see that the answer delay is perfect and audio quality is perfect. So the 3CX PBX works very good and it is stable against our DOS attack so far. 
we have tried about four methods but it still works and we will continue to research and we will publish new updates